One of the most important things that prepares youngsters for school is eye-hand coordination. In this activity, we use a template, which is a wagon wheel, and we're going to work by covering one eye with one hand and looking at the, the various lines as we go slowly across, pursuing across, pursuing up, to the top and down to the bottom by going up the slide and down the slide slowly. These movements should all be conducted as slow as the youngster can move and it's fine to put content into the activity so that the youngster is, for example, going to the South Pole here, moving up to the equator going across the world at the equator and moving then on up to the North Pole. Well, good. We would do this activity using each eye individually, that is the right hand following, followed by the right eye, the left eye following the left hand, and both eyes fo open following the dominant hand. We would do this slowly for about 10 minutes. Now what that amounts to is about 10 movements on each one of these lines going two directions. And that takes about 10 minutes for both eyes. As I say, this is one of the most important readiness activities that a youngster can develop. And it has high payoff in terms of writing, reading, and being able to notice where the numbers are on the paper in math activity. Put your thumbs up like this, look at one thumb, look at the other thumb, look back at the first thumb, look at the other thumb, look at me, look at one thumb, look at the wall behind me, look at one thumb, look at the other thumb, look back at the wall, look at one thumb, look back at the wall, look at the other thumb, look at the wall, look at your thumb. Good job. One of the most integrating activities that we can do with youngsters is to do marching in place, provided that we lift the elbows high, like this. Here we go. We can also add nursery rhymes or syllabications, such as kangaroo, kangaroo, alligator, alligator. Let's do a nursery rhyme. Hickory dickory dock. Now you say it. The mouse ran out Good job. You can see that this is fun. Kids like it. Enjoy. important skills that young children can have as a readiness for first grade is near point convergence and we're going to train that right now. Look at the forefinger of your hand here as we move that toward the bridge of the nose the eyes should be able to come together and converge to within about two inches of the nose, two inches of the bridge of the nose. 
and hold it there. We're going to repeat this about 10 times. Look at your finger. We do this slowly, and the eyes are coordinating, looking at the same point in space. This is an important activity in preparation for any kind of pencil paper skill or reading. You want to do it uh, at least 10 to 20 times per day. If you want to improve convergence, that is the ability of the two eyes to come together on one object in space, then you cover up one eye and practice following the finger. Look right here at your finger. Coming across the midline. Here the eye is tucked way in there by the nose and it's holding wonderfully. And we follow it again here. Let's do it slowly so that the eye has a chance to actually follow smoothly across. We do that 10 times or 20 times with each eye. And then we conclude by doing the standard push-up again as we did before, like so. And we'd come in only as far as the youngster could really hold that convergence. Good work.